Greetings, this is your Tactical Chef and Camo Gourmet, Spec Ops 56, along with my cameraman John Toe and my wife, the famous Invisible Woman, coming to you with round number two of the great Chicken Chili Taste Off semi finals. So, uh, we're going to start this off. Uh, by letting the Invisible Woman make her pick of uh, which chili will be one of the three contestants today. So go ahead. How about the denizens? Denizens. That's this one? Mm -hmm. Aha. All right, the denizens is contender number one. John? I'm going to pick armor chili. That's what you're right down on the bottom. Okay. Armor chili will be contender. Number two, and I think I will pick one of the store brands. Uh, I think I'll pick the clear value. So this should be an interesting matchup. Now you all know how it works from here. Uh, we will go and take the chilies in, put them in their respective pots, heat them all up, and we're, not, we're just going to go ahead and bypass all that as far as the video goes and when we come back it'll be when the chili is ready to taste. So we will see you in the tactical kitchen right about then. Okay we're here in the tactical taste testing kitchen and our three contestants are hot and ready to be tasted. <coughs> so I think we will start with the clear value. I believe I got this from uh, Bilo, but I'm not positive. Okay, that's yours, John. Come on around. Famous Invisible Woman. And one for the famous visible me. Okay, let's uh, check it out. Smell the chili. Chili yeah, sauce, chili, chili powder. powder. Chili powder right off the bat. Mm. <clears throat> Big chunks of meat. Yep. Beans are well done. Beans are tender. Mild chili powder heat mm -hmm. and flavor. Mm -hmm. the sauce is thick enough without being too thick. Okay, anything to say about this one? No. Okay. To me, it's got just the right amount of heat, uh, right amount of chili powder. It's a good mild flavor. Yeah, it is good. All right. Now, close the oven. Mm. 
and then go with the denim. Right off the bat, I can say that the denison is thicker than these other two. This is a woman. powder but it's a different kind of a chili powder mm -hmm. it's not as uh, pronounced as the other one was it has more of a maybe a little garlic in it I'm not certain and like you said it is somewhat thicker than the other between the denisons and the clear value the the chili ta powder taste is a little bit more pronounced mm -hmm. but it, while it's still being mild Yes, it is thicker. The Denison's is thicker. Yeah. What do Bean, you think? Beans are about as tender as they get. Yeah. Got plenty of meat. Mm hmm Plenty of meat. Very mild. Mild flavor with just a tiny hint of the spice. Yeah, people don't care a whole lot for the chili powder. This is a, this is pretty good. Meat chunks are not as large as they were in the Clear Valley. Mm -hmm. Anything else to say before we move on to the next? No. Nope. Okay. I pretty much got it. Cleanse that palate. Mm -hmm. And now our final contestant in round two, the Armor Chili Original. This one's almost as thick as the Denison's. smell the chili powder. I can no. smell it just a little. Mm -hmm. I don't smell much else. Of the three, the chili powder seems to stand out more in the clear value. Yes, I, I agree. It sure does. Same here. It's tasty. Mm. As far as thickness goes, it seems to be in between the denizens and the chili in the clear value. You're right. Mm -hmm. You're right. Uh, once again, Beans are well done. Plenty of meat. Plenty of meat. It's not. Uh, it, it, I think the meat chunks are a little better than they were in the little bigger than they were in the denizens. Mm -hmm. Not quite as big as they were in the clear value. It just, you know, it just may be the way that is. The um, taste is salt. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It just, just a, the armor is definitely saltier than the other two. But not in a bad way. Mm -mm. It's got just enough chili powder in it and onion powder. Mm. But no heat. 
Mm-hmm. Well, I'm gonna take back just a pinch of heat on the end. Just yeah, a little yeah. bit. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's kind of tasting that uh, on the end, mm. it's sort of... Got a little bit yeah. of heat. <clears throat> Got heat in it. I just have to wait for it to build up. <laughs> okay. It kind of gets you after it's been there a while. That's pretty good. Okay. And we knew that uh, all the semi-finalists were going to be close. That's true. You know? And it is going to be a tough one. Because they're all pretty good. Or they wouldn't have made it to the semifinals. So, John, cast your vote <coughs> for winner of round two. Well, for me, it's going to be the armor chili. The armor chili? Yep. Yeah, okay. <coughs> and... For me, it's the clear one. value. You, it's the clear value. All right, tiebreaker, maybe. Don't <laughs> <laughs> tell me you like the denizens. <sighs> Well, like I say, you know, they are all close. They yeah, are, they're really all hard. different from each other. Yeah. But, you know, it's hard hard to say for certain. Uh, for me, they were all equally, they're almost equally good, just the clear value stood out a little bit more okay. than the others. Mm -hmm. Okay, what, how, what, what was it that stood out that made Chili your powder. decision? Chili powder flavor. Okay. Yeah, it was close for me too because of the chili powder, but uh, it wasn't pronounced as much as in the armor chili, but I liked the heat at the end. Mm -hmm. <sighs> for me, I didn't like the heat at the end so much. Mm -hmm. I mean, it wasn't bad, but just... Yeah. Uh, <sighs> I think I'm going to have to vote for the clear value. All right. They were all close. They all had their positives and their negatives. Yeah. And for me, I think part of it was the same as her, that uh, I like the, the mild chili powder flavor in it. And I also like the bigger chunks of meat. Mm -hmm. uh, and I think this is another one of those that it, 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 it makes a perfect base for throwing in whatever you want to throw in to improve it to your tastes. Um, they were all good. It's a close one. And, uh, you know, I like this. I like that the armor chili being slightly saltier. It wasn't overwhelmingly salty, but it did have a little saltierness than the other two. You know, I like the flavors of the denizens. But if I have to pick one, which I do, I've got overall, I'd have to pick the clear value chili with beans. And I thought I said, I think that came from Bilo, and that's a dollar nineteen. Whereas the uh, let's see, the armor chili was a dollar sixty-nine, and the Denison's, which was kindly. Uh, donated to me by one of my subscribers, Craig Lee. Uh, and, uh, Craig, sorry, didn't make it to the finals. That's just the way it goes. It was a dollar twenty-five where he buys his. So, all right, that takes care of round number two of the Great Can Chili semifinals. We're getting closer and closer to the final winner. The the. Uh, excitement is building up and uh, we will get to the next round just as quick as we can until then this is your tactical chef and camouflage gourmet spec ops 56 the famous invisible woman and my faithful Indian companion John Toe saying so long and see you in the next round.